also like I was saying, some of the really nice winter accessories or features. Blowing fan off the turbo exhaust makes sense. Uh, instead of you know doing a heater where you're tapping into the coolant system, um, simplify things. Simple, simple. Sometimes simple is better. Um, yeah, and then most of you with these bigger units are going to need something like lower doors. Very handy. Uh, keeps the snow from piling in on your lap. Upper windows, not 100% necessary, but really nice. Kind of keeps that heat in. Provides a little bit different environment in there when you're out in the cool, even though you're bundled up with layers. Um, you can jump into something a little bit warmer. It's just more comforting. I've done it both ways without windows, with windows. I've also done it with a windshield and without a windshield. I do prefer the windshield for sure. Um, winter, snow, you're going to want a winch. Definitely going to want a winch. Lower doors, upper windows, front glass is nice. Uh, the rear window also helps keep the heat in. Another nice feature, rear winch. Having the rear hitch set up and then wiring it to the back and setting yourself up with a rear winch because when you dive into the snow, a lot of times you need to be pulled back. Um, if you're like me and you go by yourself, you want to go back, not further in, so a front winch doesn't do a whole lot of good. Got to have that rear winch. Um, but yeah, one of my favorite new items is that turbo heater. Very, very nice, folks. Um, also, the tablet holder up here gives you a little bit extra glove space. Put some gloves in there and a hat. Uh, definitely nice to have gloves and a hat in the wintertime. Um, temperature changes real quick. As you can see, it's not too bad out here right now. But, excuse me, at night, it's about 20 degrees out. <laughs> We're gonna trek on up this, as you can see Razor making his way up in blue. darn we've got a down tree and I used all my battery power um, cutting firewood hmm so I forgot my extra batteries yeah I've got my smaller saw with me but 
I have that for backup only in case I'm on my way out and the wind's blowing and drops a tree and I get trapped. I need to have a saw to get out. So I won't use all my saw to get in, um, or all my juice, if you will. I'm gonna carry two saws. So, yeah. Hmm, here we are. We're gonna turn around here. Well, actually, the boys and I are probably gonna hike up on this ridge and go up that way. It's a bummer. I had my extra battery and my 12 volt uh, Milwaukee charger that charges the 18 volt batteries um, set out. We can take them out of my razor. Um, I forgot them. Yeah. Always happens. What are you doing over there? So, I just hope that. My new Maverick R will be as reliable as my Razor and my X3 have been um, where I haven't been left out stranded, knock on wood, by myself. Change a belt, no problem. If you don't have a belt issue, what's the next thing, All right? Battery, I would say, voltage issue, and that thing has a lot of computer to it, so I'll have to watch that. Um, you don't want to be out screwing around like I am right now and leave an accessory on or have something drawing battery. I'm sure it'll be fine. Uh, any other concerns you guys think of, certainly leave in the comment section for me. Uh, yeah, hit that subscribe, like, maybe this content can spread to more people, right? Mm -hmm.